the one in paper and mushroom. I think there's a uh... The idea came about when I was looking at packaging. Since mushroom has been used to replace polystyrene, and polystyrene is known to be a good sound conductor because it's full of air, I started to test if actually the nature counterpart would also do the same thing, and it did. But it had a different timbre. On va le remplir. Et on voit, euh, on voit pas trop le mycelium, mais il est là. D'ici uh, cinq jours, ça va ressembler à du bris, à une croûte de bris. Just like being a kid playing in dirt. You know. Why is it popular now when it's been around forever? You know? You know, I'm, I'm experimenting to help the cause, so in some way, yeah. The strands that grow underneath, they can take the shape we want. There's something really beautiful about that, even though the fruit has a specific shape, the roots doesn't. So you can mold it. You don't have to remove material. It's actually the material itself that will fill up the gaps. So it, it's interesting to think about molding a guitar instead of like carving out a guitar. That's with leftover of the first bag I grew with some of my students. Then we pivoted online, you know, March 2020. Just leftover from like another guitar. Leftovers are the best. If you speaker, it was louder. And then in real life, when it's done, it was not. And I realized the... Uh, my dream is for a big company to say, let's produce it, 50 bucks, every kid can have one. 